Hey guys, so the video you're about to watch, I filmed forever ago when I was home for Christmas break. It's now February. I'm terrible at YouTube, but I really want to try and I thought this video was like, okay, so I am going to edit it and upload it. I'm sorry, I suck at YouTube, but I'm, I'm going to try. I'm going to try a lot better and a lot harder to be better. And yeah, so I hope you enjoy this video. I explained it poorly in the beginning, but I basically do like a week of hairstyles with me or like how I wear my hair for a week and so there you go get seven hairstyles kind of um but yeah hey guys what's up it's Marcella um so I'm back it has been several months since I posted on YouTube really bad at it. I film a lot of videos and then I'm like, this is stupid and I delete it. But people have been asking me for hairstyle videos on my TikTok, so I thought I would do one. <sighs> I guess. As you guys can tell, my hair has grown a lot since my last video. Like a lot. It's quite a bit longer. Um, and I have changed my routine up. So let me know if you guys want like an updated curly hair routine and I can do that for you. This is day one curls this is gonna be a like a week a week in my hair um so this is just day one usually day one i'm gonna wear it loose because i want the curls to dry either loose or in a really really like loose um bun on the top of my head with a like a satin hair tie i'll show you like this this one my sister made me i'll link her um website in the description yeah this is day one curls i'll show you the back and stick around for some hairstyle inspo i guess all right bye hey guys day two i'm back um i haven't really done much today i showered and didn't get my hair wet because my curls still looked fine honestly usually my hair would probably stay like this all day um, but I'm filming this YouTube video, so I'll put my hair in a hairstyle. Yeah, my hair is, curls are still holding up good. Uh, I'm just going to do a time lapse of me doing the hairstyle itself, and I'll do like a voiceover explaining it. Um, so yeah, here's day two. Let's style her. Okay, for the style, I just put the headband on, pull out my little pieces in the front, and then pull up half and put it right behind the back of the headband, and then just spruce up my little curlies. Okay, so here's the style. Um, it's just a simple half up, half down. I promise the styles are going to get a little bit more imaginative. This is really a simple, good second day curl or first day curl hairstyle. Um, this one is one that I would suggest doing on dry hair so that you can get the, the volume. It's gone. No, it's still there. No, it's gone. Uh, so yeah, this is day two, and I will see you guys tomorrow for day three of my hair. <laughs> All right, it's day three. Obviously, these curls are kind of—they're kind of getting a little done now i have a busy day today i'm going back home for winter break and i don't really have time to like shower and wash my hair and stuff so we're gonna be doing another really really easy style today all you need for this is two to four hair ties kind of depending on the thickness of your hair and again some kind of head covering i'm using a black bandana because it matches my outfit if depending on your hair you might need water to like work be able to work your hair but yeah Okay, and we're gonna do the time lapse now, okay. I just start by loosely parting my hair in the middle and putting it into two low ponytails and pulling out my little hair strands and then I'm gonna put the bandana on and make my little buns and I just kind of mess around with these until they're right and then I just spruce up my little curls in the front and that's it. Okay, so I'm back, I put all my joy on and such and here is the final hairstyle and depending on like the fanciness of the scarf you can kind of dress it up a little bit dress it down um guys look at my earrings so yeah uh that's that's it that's the hairstyle okay. I will 
See you all tomorrow. In a different location, I won't be here anymore. I'm going home, so I'll probably be whispering because even though my parents know I do social media stuff, I'm still kind of embarrassed when people I know see it. And so I don't want them to know that I'm filming, so I'll probably sound like this. But yeah, I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. <laughs> Guys, when I get out, oh my god, it's gonna take me so long to detangle. Hi, I'm back. Um, with wet hair and the hiccups, so I'm a little out of breath because I've been really aggressive. As I said yesterday, I'm whispering some home. There they are. I do another simple hairstyle because this one feeds into two days worth of hairstyles. Um, you'll see what I mean tomorrow. Very simple, and I'm gonna get started. So this is just, it's just a Dutch braid. I just uh, part my hair and then do a Dutch braid and leave my little curls out in the front. I always have those out. I'm not gonna try and teach you how to do a Dutch braid right now, but it is an extremely helpful braid to know how to do for curls. So I suggest you go ahead and YouTube that and find out how to do it. Okay, I just finished one braid. I'm gonna do the other off camera because I can break faster, but I'm looking at it here. <laughs> I'm all done. This is a very unexciting style. I wear this one like usually once a week at least. So, so yeah, that's it. Okay, hi, day five. I don't think I've had the same camera angle for a single day of this, but. <clears throat> Uh, here's the braids. They're very frizzy. I have very frizz prone hair in general. I don't know why I didn't do my makeup before filming this video because I'm looking a little crusty, but Good. We're gonna skip to the time lapse now. You're gonna hear me talking. We've done this before So I literally just I'm gonna unravel the braids up to the base of my skull and then fluff out the hair and Spruce up my little curls in the front and that's it. Okay, so here we have the style. I usually do the day after braids. Mm. Why didn't I put the I can't figure out why I wouldn't have put the phone here to film. It's much better lighting. Um, don't let anyone tell you that you're too old to wear pigtails. You're not. Wear them. They look adorable. But yeah. Day five. Down. See you guys tomorrow. Okay. New day. New spot for filming. Um, this is a style that you can definitely wear for two days if you want to. Uh, I usually don't, but you can. And I'm going to film the first part of this not as a time lapse because um, I just want to show you how I part the hair to start. Depending on how you want like the style to look, you can definitely do real parts. I don't because I like it to look more like loose and chill. But essentially, you want to go right around your temple and just go back i don't part it again because i like it to look like a little messy um i think that like for me is the look i want but that's just what i like so do what you like and then i'm gonna do the same thing on the other side I'm trying to make sure they're kind of even and then i'm gonna put this i'll take a hair tie and put this out of the way so this is what we start with looking really good um, and then you're gonna take about to about a little bit behind your ear, like that. Flip all of that back. Do the same thing on the other side. To okay. Um, and now I'm gonna start braiding. We're gonna do braids on these two, just two little Dutch braids. So yeah, I'm gonna time lapse that now. So for this style, I'm gonna start with the little braids, and you're just gonna be doing some mini. Um, Dutch braids on either side. I take out the hair by my ears and by my face just to grab my face. There's my brother, he came in. And yeah, I just do too many braids um, on both sides. And then I'm going to move up to the top braids. So I start with the bottom ones because it just makes it easier to not grab the hair in the bottom braids. But yeah, once you get Dutch braiding down, 
this style doesn't take too much longer than like 10 minutes to do. Okay, and we're done. So I'll give you a little look. <laughs> like so definitely take more hair than I did from here it should go further back I think because because I didn't go for far enough back it kind of lays down if you can't see that let me like if I don't have the bobby pins in it just kind of like so definitely don't do that the bobby pins fix everything so yeah I will see you tomorrow for the seventh and final day of hair Hello, good morning, it is day seven, finally. I'm back in the same place, bad lighting, but that's okay. Um, this is my hairstyle from yesterday. I was lounging around a lot yesterday, so it kind of didn't, you know, hold up very well. But I could probably make this work for a second day. I'm not gonna though, I'm gonna do something different. Okay, I figured out what I'm gonna do. We're gonna turn on the time lapse and you'll hear me in a second. My hair looks not great. <laughs> So I'm just gonna start by taking out my braids. Obviously you don't need to have had your hair braided like this to do this style, but I'm gonna use those same sections that I used yesterday and I'm gonna throw my hair up into a ponytail and then work that ponytail into a bun. And I use some bobby pins and just kind of mess around with them until I got them how I like them. But you could also just leave them in the ponytails. That's another kind of fun look, but yeah, that's it. Okay, here's the final product. I didn't really show very well what I did at the end, but I was just like refreshing my curls, essentially, if you guys want me to do a video on how I do that, um, let me know. So yeah, this one is day seven, the final day of hair. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you want a specific type of video, please comment under this video. I'm gonna try and start posting more consistently. I know it's been like months since I last posted, but again, thank you so much for a thousand subscribers and I'll try and do some more videos on YouTube. They're a lot more time consuming than TikToks, obviously, so that's why I haven't done them as much. Merry Christmas. I probably will not post this till like January, so. Um, girl, it is February 25th. Merry Christmas, if you celebrate it. Um, or if you don't, you can, I, can, I think I can still wish you a Merry Christmas. That's not problematic, right? Yeah. Thank you guys. And I'll put all my links to stuff in the description. And I will see you next time. I hope you guys enjoy.